And uh, speaking of flags, how about this? Did you know that Idaho at one point, at one point, was home to the worst flag in North America? Well, that's according to a vexologist who is a person who studies flags, and I definitely said that wrong, but anyways, they're legit. They know what they're talking about. And they said that Pocatello didn't stand for it, so they fixed it. We'll show you how in today's 208 Redive. <laughs> And how would you like your eggs? Jerry's Jumbo Cafe in Pocatello. Jumbos. How about a little coffee? Is your typical diner. Morning, guys. How are you? Serving your typical diner fare. Egg over easy hash browns and sausage. And yep. where you'll hear your typical topics of the day. Montpelier was where they was hooking up to the steam. Yep. Worries about water. Now, now they're all worried we got too much now. Do you want coffee? With a side of gripes. Cold enforcement. About the government. City of Pocatello. The morning crowd that usually congregates at this counter. Yeah, just come in here for the entertainment. Can complain yeah. with the best of them. The American way. Even yeah. about the worst of things. The ugliest one in the country. Rod Teeter is talking about Pocatello's city flag. Really, we have a flag? The one deemed by experts Patty or Link? as the worst across an entire continent. I don't even know what the Pocatello flag looks like. <laughs> oh! Yeah. This is what someone decided was the Gate City's garish emblem of honor. Yeah, it's ugly. <laughs> Only it wasn't really meant to be a flag. It was originally designed as a logo for a Chamber of Commerce Community Pride program. Greg Gunter designed it back in 1999, and it spread around the city, still showing up today on shop windows and appropriately on trash trucks. Mysteriously, it made its way onto a couple of flags. But to this day, we don't know who did it. One flew briefly in front of the city's water treatment plant. And the other was stuffed in the corner at the library. And that flag would have remained just a footnote. It's actually pretty big. An archive in a storage closet. This is the flag. Fans of my radio show and podcast. But then Roman Mars, a man considered by many as a design guru, gave a TED talk. Yes, he did about flags. And finally, when we're all done, we can do something about Pocatello, Idaho, considered by the North American Vexillological Association as the worst city flag <laughs> in North America. <laughs> oh, sure. It seemed funny at the time. That thing has a trademark symbol on it, people. But not to everyone. You know, I giggled at first. No, actually, I didn't even giggle. I, now that I think, I was just. I was a little angry inside. Casey was like a lot of people in Pocatello back in 2015, completely unaware the city even had a symbol. I was the mayor for, what, five and a half, six years before I realized that we had a flag. But being belittled by vexillologists, nobody needs that. And to know that millions of people were watching this and reacting that way probably um, made me want to do something about it. So Casey and a lot of others did. To be able to be the worst, that was a, a gift from heaven. The city saw it as an opportunity and formed a design committee, which was soon overwhelmingly wrapped 709 in flag ideas. So 709 uh, from th over 30 U.S. states and 26 different countries around the world. This month, they will whittle those hundreds down to 10. And this summer, they plan to unveil a new version of Pocatello's flag, a standard with a higher standard. And hopefully, uh, we end up with, uh, we go from worst to first. Oh, they'll still be proud to be Pocatello. We are proud to be Pocatello. But that banner from before will likely be banished once again to the back room of the library. Proud to be Pocatello. Proud to be Pocatello, but maybe with a different flag representing us. Brian Holmes, Idaho's News Channel 7. If you know of a bad flag, we'd love to see it. And you know how to get in touch with us. You can text us anytime, 208-321-5614. Please include your name and hashtag the 208. Rolls on after this.